Hello, I'm Brianna, so I'm interviewing Bridget, Eloise, and the Oyo about the artwork in Room 12. Bridget, yeah, how long did it take to make it? Around about three weeks. Oh, yeah. yeah what was your favourite part? Finishing. Leo, yeah, what was the most boringest part? Probably dotting. Okay, thank you for interviewing me. Hi, I'm Nathaniel, and today we will be interviewing Adam and you about the paper cranes they made on Monday. So, which of the six C's were you doing on Monday? Communication. Uh, yep. How long do you think it took you to make these paper cranes? Uh, 15 minutes to an hour. How hard was it from a scale to 1, in, one to 10, 10 being the hardest? How hard do you think it was? Um, maybe f about 9 or 8. 8 or 9. Yeah, 8 or 9. So, how did you make these paper cranes on Monday? <clears throat> so first, uh, we f uh, found ins instructions on Google and tried to explain it to our um, partner, to our partner, which was Adam for me. And um, we didn't be we weren't able to do it because it was hard to do it without um, mm -hmm. images or a YouTube video. Mm -hmm. And then the next day, the whole class uh, did paper cra did paper cranes, um, and we got to look at tutorials of how to do it so we didn't take five years <laughs> at making paper cranes. The, the um, folding parts were quite hard for me. Mm, mm -hmm. Because it like, showed just do a normal X with a cross in between and then like bends the paper mm -hmm. before it rips. Mm -hmm. I know, it's like super I hard. And I see a book you have, could you tell me what that's about? Uh, so this is what the paper cranes were based off, uh, mm -hmm. the Sadako and the Thousand Paper Cranes. Mm -hmm. it's she a, gets yeah. a sickness and there's a legend that she has to make a thousand paper cranes to get her, to make her feel better. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, like um, if you made it if a sick person makes a thousand paper cranes, it sh they said that it would, um, the gods would um, answer her wish. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She lived... Um, oh, wait. Yeah, she got um, the disease, which was an atom bomb disease. Mm -hmm. I forgot from what it was. From Hiroshima? Yeah, from yeah. the Hiroshima bombing. Well, she got soon gravely ill with leukemia? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. which is a as well to see. That's very interesting, but um, we'll just wrap up the interview there and hope you guys enjoyed. Yep.